So what you're watching here is a laser-assisted spinal restoration treatment in action at the spine level using our model spine here and using the laser and decompression device all at the same time here. So the device here is the spine specialist. It's essentially a decompression table, non-surgical spinal decompression, with a combined simultaneous class 4 laser embedded in the center here. So what I'd like to show you is what happens at the spinal level when we do one of these treatments. So <clears throat> as you can see these are the restraints. So I have a little pillow here to mimic the uh, the rib cage. So this restraint goes around the rib cage and it holds holds in the ribs here. This restraint here that you see at the side this actually gets wrapped around the pelvis. So just like that and like that to hold the pelvis in place. So as you can see, the laser is fully exposed to the back of the spine here so it can travel into the tissues and, and reach the spine. Um, when the traction occurs, what happens is these two pieces of the table right here will actually come apart. So I'll just manually pull them and it'll hold the pelvis in place and provide a bit of a stretch to the disc like that. It'll open the space up trying to increase space between these bones. So for purposes of viewing I am going to remove this part of the straight because I'm going to show you what happens when we do the laser. So for a little bit of background on this device um, this is actually the uh, the first and only combined uh, laser uh, and spinal decompression device that exists. Um, Spine Advance we hold the patent uh, on this device. It was created four or five years ago uh, from uh, my own uh, office uh, to use on my own patients and it has been working so well that we decided uh, that we need to be able to offer it to other practitioners uh, worldwide. So uh, this is the stage that we're at uh, for that. So um, this video was created uh, for a little bit more background as to how the machine works and uh, you know what it does so so uh, doctors and patients can understand and, and see what um, what exactly we're doing with the device and why we're doing it. Um, so I will arm the laser here now. There we go. And as you'll see, the laser will glow red. And that's just the aiming beam. But um, when the laser is armed, uh, that's the way it looks uh, with the patient on top. Uh, so uh, as I mentioned before, we're going to be doing simultaneous traction and laser therapy on a patient, uh, automated laser therapy. Um, for the purposes of this video, we won't be doing the traction component because it's kind of hard to be getting uh, a hold of this, uh, this bony gentleman here. Um, but I will show you how the laser travels around and I'll explain as it's moving uh, what it's doing and why. Uh, so I'm just going to hit the laser so you can have a little view of what happens when we activate it. So the laser will move down into position and I'm going to come across the top here so you can see where it's starting. When the laser begins you're going to see a little bit extra of a glow and as it's traveling through there it gets a little bit bright and again as it goes through the holes in the sacrum and you'll see the lines from the laser glowing as it begins to treat the areas of the model spine. So this is generally where a patient will be positioned slightly a lower uh, a little bit at, depending on where the uh, where we're trying to hit but as you can see the L4 L5 level right here is about in the center of the machine so generally we're capturing with laser therapy from about the bottom of the sacroiliac joints which is about here uh, all the way up to L1 L2 depending on the, the size of the patient. So you'll see the disc here glows a little bit as the laser comes through it. So um, on a live patient what happens is that laser actually penetrates into the tissue. I'll try to get a little bit more of a view here. As it's coming you can see this little glow here. And as it's coming across you'll see a little bit of a glow in that bottom disc where the laser is actually 
So let me penetrate in. So the goal of this is to try to increase the circulation at those disc levels and uh, and at the, the nerve roots here. So uh, these nerves that are coming out here, the laser can actually penetrate into the tissue to try to reduce inflammation, try to relieve pain. Um, it provides uh, um, topical heating, which also uh, relaxes muscle tissue and the key to a effective decompression session is actually to achieve muscle relaxation so a lot of the things that you hear about decompression how they change the pull patterns and angles of pull and etc 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 to achieve muscle relaxation uh, well my perspective has always been with the laser assisted spinal restoration treatment that um, why do we need to fool the muscles into relaxing by using different patterns uh, when we can actually directly influence the relaxation of the muscle tissue uh, through a modality such as laser which is uh, proven to actually uh, reduce inflammation and re relieve that muscle uh, tension which would possibly interfere with a uh, uh, with an effective decompression session um, so we've created a healing synergy here um, we are using the laser to increase the soft tissue healing capability to reduce the uh, inflammation uh, and then we're using the decompression to actually create a increased space and a negative pressure in these discs uh, which will help relieve pressure from the disc area which will help relieve pressure from any of these nerves that could have become compressed um, and um, relieve some of the general muscle tension that you would feel throughout the spine So you can see the laser as it continues to course through. So what you will get is actually an entire treatment of the lumbar spine, all of the postural muscles. Um, it will come back. Uh, different patterns are set to actually focus on certain disc areas. So if someone has a L4, L5 or L5, S1 uh, disc injury, we can actually have the laser come back for some of the programs and focus directly on that disc for a double dose of laser. Um, what you're seeing here is just the general low back pain dose which covers the entire uh, area. So I hope this gives you a little bit of an idea of what uh, the laser assisted spinal restoration achieves. Um, and uh, thank you very much for watching.